in one place they start to create more. The other way is going to be fragmentation. You can break pieces off of coral and play percent of the entire ocean's biodiversity. That's a really big that's really big and important. However, 60% of all coral on the planet is endangered in some sort of way. So, we're trying to work with uh, companies Really? Not her, but she's so do they get much bigger than this or? Yeah. 
And the cool thing about sharks like her is she acts a lot like a cat, so she'll sit in one spot for a long period of time, just kind of chilling. Sea urchins. I don't remember the exact species of sea urchin in here, but she also, this girl also does have a neighbor. If you look in here, you'll see some really odd looking, kind of like the epaulette like thing that's on the because of her spots. She's really cool. Epaulette sharks also get their name as the walking sharks from Australia. These guys are, uh, are known to walk around on their fins. The pectoral and the pelvic fins allow her to walk along her habitat, as well as get up out of the water. Her favorite, and he's really funny. As for the blue goes, we have a total of five. For oldest and youngest, their names are Emac, Whisper, Maple, Keeping Crime. Speaking of animals, here's one of my favorites here at the aquarium. Sam yeah. Shark River, I love everything sharks. Look up. 
Thanks for tuning in, guys. We had an amazing time. Hopefully, this might be your next journey. And make sure to check out the exclusive tour. Peace and plants.